to put him into any sort of space. The Hadre deflection, South Africa lead. The chance here for Arrows to go further ahead, yeah. The Hadre! Oh, he's gone! Looking at that, you'd think he was a goal-scoring machine, but he's a holding midfielder. He's Bafana Bafana's 54 caps in his career. It's KG Kachisuri Khachwa. Welcome to Sport at 10. What a career. What a time. It's fantastic to have you back with us uh, in uh, South Africa. How are you, KG? I'm good, man. How are you? I'm good. So shall Thank you. Ah, man. Unyezi. My freedom is taken away now. You're calling it freedom? It's gone. You're now where you need to be. Married. Solid. It's gone. Freedom is gone. You know, all of these things, <laughs> building. Sure. Are, are you, how does it feel now to be a married man? Oh, it feels good, man. It feels good. Uh. I feel like I'm a man now, you know. But uh, obviously, we've been to, uh, together for a long time, me and the missus, you uh. know. I had to show some commitment to her, to her family, and obviously, you know, to my family also. Now, there's one thing that people, and you, this is the one thing that you don't get credit for. Mm. 2010, mm. opening game. Mexico, South Africa, everyone knows Shaba. Marabate will repass it to Kimang. And young Guadisa. Young Guadisa, but yeah, uh, we, we do talk about it in Alishawa sometimes, uh. you know. And he always like thank me, I'm a born on Pileda. So, <laughs> Killa Pass, Munda. I'm the one who gave you the pass. Ufile! The Killa Pass. Kimufile. And then. How about he had no away? excuse. He had no excuse. He had to finish. And okay, as much as I'm giving you the credit and saying, mm. well done, got a killer pass, mm. I also have to say, in that same World Cup, KG, you got two yellow cards while was suspended mm. for the game against France. And we won against France. Mm. But you were not there. Ish. So what are you trying to say? No, I'm just trying to ask, Jorge. Oh. What, did we draw against Mexico? KG is there. Drew, yeah. Lose against uh, Uruguay. Uruguay. KG is there. Mm. But second yellow card. Mm. Then Utuile. Mm. France, no KG. 2-1 victory. <laughs> it's starting to look like I'm seeing a pattern. Yeah. <laughs> no, but to be honest with you, we should have won the Mexico game, if you remember quite well. Uh. We had one-on-ones, Kila, I think, Teco. And uh, the goal we considered, obviously, uh, we shouldn't have considered that goal against Mexico, I mean, Uruguay. Yeah, but the red card, you know, in the first half. Kune getting the red card. Yeah, Kune got the red card. And, and again, if you looked at the team we played against, it was a tough team. I've always Uruguay. wanted to ask you that. Like, I mean, playing against someone like Suarez, mm. Forlan, mm. they were there in your area where you yeah. have to... But yeah, but you know those are clever players. You know, uh, if if what Obamaka guy can allow only, I wanna show him who who I am. Then you're gonna get exposed easily. Uh. But if you go there, you know, composed, and you can easily, you know, take the ball off them. But uh, again, you have to give them the the necessary respect uh, they deserve. Mm. Mm. Now, KG, you're back in South Africa. Mm. Let's talk about coming back and then after the break, we're going to take a break and then I'm going to talk to you about what it was like overseas. Mm. What's it like being back home? It feels good, you know. Uh, it feels good to be back home, with family, friends, and again playing for, for Golden Arrows, playing in the PSL again. That's, that's, that's obviously what I wanted. That I wanted surprised to. a lot of people though. I know. Because before, how about Utlaro, KG? Yo, KG mm. can come back. And I'm going to share with South Africans because KG, you know, go Cardiff City, they were the, the money was astronomical. You know, there's rumors it was a, as much as a million rand a month that KG was earning. So the South African clubs were saying, you, you, mm. <laughs> how do we get there? <laughs> and then it was the big name clubs that were all being spoken about. Yeah. Then you chose to come to Golden Arrows. You surprised South people. Yeah, I know. I've always wanted to come back to Arrows, you know, for, for what they've done for me in the past. Uh, the support they gave me, even when I was still playing in England, mm. you know, we were in contact with Rossi Sumato all the time. Uh, so for me, coming back to Arrows, it's, it's more like giving back to them, you know, uh, trying to help them achieve whatever they want to achieve. And here I am, I'm back, and I'm, I'm enjoying it thus far. Milan and Amantha, are you getting it here? Ha, <laughs> not really. <laughs> <laughs> you left Golden Arrows, mm. KG, 2009, to join Fulham. Mm -hmm. How does that happen? What does it feel like? It felt great at the moment, uh, at that time, actually. Um, 
I went over there. I didn't know anyone. Uh, it was a bit of a struggle for a couple of weeks and, until I met some fellow South Africans who helped me to settle in. What struggle was I didn't know anyone. Like yeah, but I know. I mean, I can't. I can't be only living football all the time. Sounds like you're about. It's an L. Yeah. Then you met some people. Yeah, yeah, I met some 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 friends. They from South Africa, and then they they showed me around. They taught me a lot of things. Uh. Yeah, and then uh, again there was John Pencil who also helped me a lot to settle go 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 fuller. Uh, mm. Assistant coach at Chiefs. Yeah. Oh wow. John, yeah. You had you had a relationship in there. Yeah, yeah we played together. Go full on with John. We were mm. Close friends. Le Le John and the team. First season goes okay. Mm. It's your first season. You don't play too much, but you're playing. Yeah, Fourteen games. Mm. I think yeah. Mark Hughes. Then the second season, the coach Albo when you were No. Doesn't see you at all. Jala Haiwan. Haiwan, and that's it. But you know, it happens. It happens uh, a lot. Go Europe when when the new coach comes in. He'd obviously bring in his staff and then obviously some players that he prefers. Mm. And it was obviously going to be difficult. Was you know, it bad when they said, let's maybe put you on loan, you go to Crystal Palace? No, no, no. Uh, you know, I felt, Lenore, you know what, let me go there, uh, play some football and hopefully come back. But then after then, the coach for Crystal Palace was like, oh, OK, I want you to stay. And you were brilliant, man. Yeah. You showed them flames. Yeah. Took them to the Premiership. Mm. Huh? That was, yeah. That was the highlight. first season. Yeah. A real highlight of your career? A real highlight. Is that the career. one? Yeah, that's the one I would say. The fact that you were promoted to the EPL? Yeah. What made that so special? Uh, I don't know, man. Uh, for the fact that I couldn't play enough football, go, go, go Fulham, mm. you know. For, you wanted to show people. Yeah, I wanted to show people. Or what is it that I'm capable of? I want. So obviously it was difficult going down the division, go championship. But then you manage, managed to, to, to settle. I played a number of, of games. Uh, and again in the EPL also, I played uh, quite a good number of games. Uh, how are you now? Because at the last club, Cardiff City, injury, yeah. didn't play all that much. Mm. Um, even the beginning of this season now with Golden Arrows, you missed the first six games. How mm. are you? No, I'm I'm good now. I'm good. Uh, I had to I had to stay for a couple of weeks to to decide if I want to come back to SA or go elsewhere. Uh, hence, I didn't play those games for Arrows, mm. you know. But at the end, I had to you know say like, I want to stay. I want to play some football. I will I will decide later on. What can we expect from KG this season? Uh, pff, nothing much. But I just want to go out there play football and, and and hopefully improve from 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 the last time. Bafana Bafana? At the moment, I don't know. I don't want to. I'm not thinking about it at the moment. I just want to focus on domestic football. Uh, there's good young young players who, who I think at the moment are doing great that deserve to be playing for for Bafana. So at the moment, just focus on domestic football. KG. Thank you. Thank you to Golden Arrows as well for giving you the opportunity to come up after training and get back on the flight in the morning to get back to training. Mm -hmm.